Oh, hi. There you are. Professor Frankly. Vaza, who's there? Who wants me? Ah, uh, yes, you. Now, you, uh... I've seen your face before. Yes, that face. Wait for it. Just a moment. Don't tell me now. Silence! I'll get it right. Um, it's not Gumbriel. Uh, not Eliza Gum. You're Gumbella, aren't you? You were in my archaeology class last year, am I right? Wow, yes sir, that's me! I'm Gumbella! A junior at you Goom! Go Goombas! Of course I remember you! Not to toot mine horn, but I'm pretty good at remembering. Uh, you so, you stick out in my mind because you were such an, an exceptional student! And that guy behind you is... It's a me, Mario! Who? Oh! Mario! Professor, he's Mario! You know, the famous one? Oh, my apologies. I'm such a bookworm. I haven't a clue about what he right now. In any case, what sort of Ellen brings you to also wait to a place like this? We were hoping you'd tell us about the legendary treasure said to be below Rockport. I thought that if anyone knew anything about it, uh, you would, Professor Frankly. Of course I know about it. So the reason I came here was to study that very subject. But why do you tags want to learn about the legendary treasure? You know that most say it's a little more than a fairy tale, don't you? Archaeologists and historians have to search for truth in those fairy tales, though. Me, I believe the legendary treasure truly does exist. And I really want to find it. Good point. Und well made. In that case, I'll cooperate with you however I can. First of all, about the treasure. There are many mysteries surrounding it. Some say it's an infinitely vast treasure hoard, while others say it's a magical item. Uh, some books say it's actually a monster. While still others claim it's an empty chest. So many different theories. Obviously, it's impossible to define the truth among them. But all agree on one point. To find the treasure, one must have the crystal stars. To find the treasure of yore takes the seven crystal stars to the thousand-year door. You mean the crystal stars in an old saying that super utterly people passed down? Indeed. The same, as the saying goes, if you want to find the legendary treasure, you must first collect the seven crystal stars. Hold the magical map aloft before the entrance of the thousand year door. Then the stars will light the way that leads to the stones of yesterday. Yeah, a lot of the lore I've read says that if this magical map is taken to the doorway, then it will show you where to find the crystal stars. Collect. And the thousand year door is supposedly here, deep beneath this town. Yet the crucial piece is a puzzle. The magical map is lost. If only we had that map. But we do have a professor. Or, well, not we exactly. Mario has the magical map. What? Homina hobbity, hobbity, hibbity, booby dab, homina, hoofla, hoofla. Really? You. You actually have it? Could I just take a quick look at it, if you don't mind? Astounding! This is it! The real thing! The one and only magical map! Your son are my hero! You're great! Fantastic! Wonderful, even! With this, we can find the crystal stars just by holding this aloft before the legendary door. Right on, Professor! Good golly! What are we doing just sitting here, then? Kumbella, Mario, off we must go! This instant! Let's take the magical map to the legendary door! A 
Bet you didn't know this rotten old thing came off, did you? <laughs>
man. What's up? Who's the hottie you got there with you? What's up, baby? Why don't we hang with us for a while? We play real nice. Man, what's a fine-looking Goomba doing with a Toby mustache man like that? Oh, it is, like, so sweet that you boys think I'm cute. Seriously. Yeah, guys like you make me feel like totally barfing! Now get out of our way! Ouch, that was cold. What, you're too good for us? Come off it, sister! Nobody sings us like that! Nobody! Let's get them! Ein Goomba, ein Spiny Goomba und ein Perl Goomba! My, the whole Goomba family tree! The only one I should warn you about is that fellow in the middle, the Spiny Goomba! See that spike in his head? Well, jump on that and the other one who'll take damage! The Perl Goomba's airborne, so your hammer won't reach! You'll have to jump for him. Always take your opponent's situation into consideration when fighting. Always! Oh, that's right. I forgot to tell you something vital. You can press Y to change the order you to attack in. You can attack first if you feel like it, Gumbella. Don't forget that. Owie! Later on, losers! That felt awesome! Are you ready, Mario? There are plenty more where they came from, and they'll all have it in for us! When they attack, try to hammer them or jump on them while in the field. Attack successfully, and you can perform a first strike when you enter battle. So if an enemy catches sight of you, be sure to thumb them as you go into battle. Whoa! Hey, you! Can you hear me? You can? That must mean you're the hero of legend! Only the great hero of legend can hear my voice. Yeah! Everyone else? Nothing. See, long ago, an evil spirit cast a curse on me, locking me in this box. I was bummed. I've been here ever since, waiting a long, long time for the hero to come by. So, yeah. Anyway, big guy, what brings a hero like you to a place like this? Uh, Mario, a word with you? I'm not exactly confident that we can trust this box. I think it may be best not to mention that we're, we're looking for the crystal stars. Well, drat, I just said it out loud. What's wrong with me? Oh, yeah? Searching for the crystal stars, are you now? So you really are a hero. Well, you're definitely gonna need my help if you hope to get those bad boys. So, first you should look for the key to this box. Then use it to let me out. Definitely. By the way, the key looks like this. Well, what do you think we ought to do, Mario? Well, I know my vote goes to you finding that key. I'm sure it's right here somewhere. Come on, being stuck in a box is no picnic. I'm counting on you, oh great legendary hero.